Arisa Mendoza Foresa from Phoenix, Arizona, and welcome to WBA's Agent Series. I was raised and born in Rosario Cabide, a full dadded capitan, I say. I studied in Paris Eastern University. Uh, I took up law. And of course, my undergrad uh, course is AB English. After graduation, I got married, unfortunately. But I got three children, and I'm happy about it. And as a mother, I have an American dream. And so I work in a legal office for like 17 years. And after that, um, I still wanted to go to America. And so I tried going here in 2006. I work in LA. Uh, working visa. It was hard because I wasn't from here and it's a it's a big uh, change for me because I, I was used to be in the Philippines and now going in the US and working I can I can say it's hard. And then in 2007 we I moved, me and my family, me and my children moved in Washington State and stayed there for three years and then we moved in Arizona and that's where this WBA experience started. 2013, after my dad had a stroke, well, that's the, that was the time that I met Evelyn Carrer, and that was the time that I was introduced to this insurance business. Actually, I attended the meeting, and I didn't know what they were talking about, because I was just invited by a friend. And when I sat down and listened to them, uh, I think I was convinced that this insurance is very good. And so after that, she was able to convince me to join the business, and because I was looking, that, that was the time that I was looking for a job that I can have more freedom, I can have my own time without any boss because I had to go back and forth from America to the Philippines to attend to my father's business. And so as a, a, the eldest child, I have to do this uh, like three times a year. And so what, what's, what is the work that I can do without you know, being tied up eight to five every day, Monday to Friday. So I thought that this is a good opportunity for me to really do the insurance business, which unfortunately I failed to do way back in 2010 because I was busy, you know, doing, uh, starting my life in America because I was here 2007, aside from working 2006. So the first time that I really uh, listened to Evelyn, I was convinced and I actually replaced my insurance with a good insurance that she's introducing to me at that, that time. And so I joined WBA in 2016 and because 2013 we were in another company and so we decided both of us that we should do it at home. So we formed a company uh, with Evan Kerr as the CEO and that was the time that you know I enjoyed the business but it wasn't that you know, easy. Life in the business is not that easy. I can tell you because you have so many ups and downs in the business, the experiences that will make you a uh, tough and will require some patience uh, and everything just to make it happen. The dreams, you have to dream, it's free, but dreams without action is nothing. You have to do what you have to do. You have to be coachable. That's for an agent. So as an agent, at first I wasn't coachable. I admit. And I'm sorry because it took me four years before I reached my goal. Which up to now, I'm still working for it. I'm still working to make it happen. Uh, in 2014, 2016, I'm sorry, um, the start of WBA, I had no agents. And I had no agents for, what, four years. And I wasn't happy. I was doing the business just because I wanted to do something. Because I was able to go. I, that's the, the opportunity of going back and forth to the Philippines. With doing this business, it's very uh, possible for me. But, of course, as an agent, I dream of something big. I want to be like her. I want to be like any other agents that has agents and, and you know, they have financial freedom really. So it took me four years before I, I can say that I'm going there right now. Now I have like 
14 agents and still and it started only this year this year 2019 this is the year that I started you know listening to her and I don't have any regrets because I am reaping what I sow and she was very uh, I mean supportive of me and I don't regret listening to her and that's my advice to all other agents the new ones it's gonna be hard you have to experience really those things that you don't didn't experience in the past you know clients are different some of them uh, you know you they will make you cry because you're not used to be you know in this business you don't you're not used to be talked about like things that you know their attitudes really you know bothering and really makes you uh, quit the business but don't worry it's just part of the experience you will get over it as long as you stay where you are you stay focused on what you're doing you stay coachable and you listen to your mentor you can do it now I can say I did it and I thank you Ms. Devlin Carrier and of course WB thank you